today I'm using the kettle Charlotte and this thing called a vortex what's that all about hey, yo this is dash Get ready. Yo, this is Dash, and today I'm gonna to be using Charlotte. Wait a minute, I just told you guys that. So, how about this? Let's get this thing started. So I, so I have a helper today. This is taste tester number two. Hello. In case you do not know. And we're gonna be seasoning these legs that he so diligently cleaned up for me. Though he spread them all out. So now get a glove and squish them all together, please. This Caribbean jerk seasoning, there we go. This Caribbean jerk seasoning. Yeah, just one. Use your right hand. It should be good. So I'm trying to get him more involved in the cooking. If you so. guys go back a couple years, I was in all those videos. Like, remember when we made that cream? Yes. Oh, we didn't. We assembled it. Yeah, we made. It. We didn't make it. We assembled it. Okay. He's talking about when I blew up my Volkswagen Passat. So if you want to see that video, uh, I guess it'll be over there. Hopefully that's the right side. I can never remember. Squish them all together. I thought you were supposed to get those off. What happened? I did. I didn't see these. Mm -hmm. And so I just picked it up. All right. So now, the glove really should go on your left hand. You said left I hand. know, I know, I know. And I'm getting ready to explain to you why. Because you're getting ready to, good job. All right, squish everything together, please. Goodness. Just I keep on breaking it off, that's why. All right. Is that all of it? Yeah, I got all of it. Okay, squish. Yep. Okay, so now <clears throat> take that glove off because you're not going to be able to switch the glove like I do. Now use the seasoning. Now, when we season this, I can use my left hand for glove and right hand. Yes, that's what I want you to do, but we're going to. So, season it. Not too bad, not too bad. Now, remember, fold the paper up a little bit and then you can get closer to the edge. Yeah, not bad, not bad. All right, go get another glove. Flip everything over. Don't close it, you still need it open. Yeah, I just need to put it down. Left hand, glove. The difference is? No, I'm saying put the glove on the left hand. Is it? Technical difficulties. Perfect. Do we need to make a sound effect every time you turn one over? Well, I know you're not gonna put it in, unless you will put it in. I'm not putting any sound effects in for turning the chicken legs over. This part is the part that gets cut out when you want to keep this up. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. I didn't even put any on this one. All right. Well, yeah, we can. Yep, exactly. Can we make get this show okay. on the road? All right. Come on, season. <clears throat> look at her. Look at her wrist. All right. Hold on. I mean, that was, might have been my best coverage ever. That was, but I'm going to just reinforce it. All right, now take the chicken and mix everything in and get the seasoning on everything. That's pretty good.
Now, you ready to go outside? Yes. Okay, we'll take the chicken. You want to tell them we'll see him outside in a second? I'll see you outside in a second. So I'm out in Charlotte and I have the Vortex going. And boy, oh boy, is that lid hot. Woo. So we're going to go ahead and get the grate put on. Now the way the Vortex works is the heat comes up, circulates around the top of the dome and convection makes it go back down and around. So I'm going to get the chicken lined up. I'll probably be able to space it out a little bit after I see how much chicken this actually is. Smells good already. How does it smell? Come and smell it. So what's your name? Smells hot. It smells hot. Yes, like But other than that, I got set inside. I smell the rosemary a little. Alright. You want to tell them we'll see him in about a half an hour? See you in about a half an hour. Alright, go ahead on in the house. Alright. So it's been a half an hour, just a half an hour, and these legs look pretty good. I'm actually not actually a fan of chicken legs. I think I might even eat one at least. All right, so like I said, it's been a half an hour. I'm gonna get these turned over. If you're wondering where taste testing number two is, he found something on TV and now has straight abandoned me. I actually think I'm gonna turn the meat side out. Now, this is a perfect time for you to use a, an extra long pair of tongs because you don't want to burn yourself over the heat that's coming up over here. Now I'm turning them around just so they can get even and cook on that outside edge as well but they probably would have been fine if I left them the other way. All right, these are pretty much, they look like they're almost done. I don't have a thermometer out here with me. I'll grab it on my way out the next time. See you guys in a bit. All right, so we are almost at the 15 minute mark. And let's, Temp a couple of these guys. All right, there's 179, 191, 185. We're good to go. I'm trying to go down and hit the bone. There's 180, 186, 177, Ooh, 177, 172. These guys are done. If you want to give them a good crisp for a second, you can put them right over that vortex. Oh, yeah. Time to get these off. I'll stop playing with my food. So as you can see, the wings, or excuse me, the legs turned out great. This is a very easy cook, 45 minutes pretty much all told, just under 45 minutes from the time I put the chicken out here, from the time that it looks like this. So, see you guys inside. 
All right, guys. So here is the jerk chicken legs. Smells really good. All right. There's a taste test of number three size one and a taste test of number two size one. Go ahead. Tell me what you think. Shouldn't be too too hot. Let it cool for a moment. Is it too spicy for you? It has a little kick. Too. Okay. <laughs> Careful. What? It's really hot. I mean, it's hot. And you said, "Oh, I let it sit." I had let it sit for like a minute or two. It's good. I like the flavor. Think? It's a jerk seasoning, so it has a little kick. Um, other than that, I like it. Okay. So, truth be told, I've done, I've done wings with this jerk chicken seasoning, and on that vortex, they come out just the same exact way, nice and crisp. The wings I did were a little crispier because I had the heat up a little higher. I turned the heat to about three, or I turned the vent to about three quarters of the way open, just so it wouldn't burn them. Are you okay? Okay. All right. So I know some of you guys have asked me, you know, when I do dinners like this, what are the sides? So today the sides are going to be, I have some, some cucumber, cucumber and taste test number three insisted that we have some baby carrot. So we're going to have basically a deconstructed salad with our chicken. So that's pretty much it. So Deconstructed means we took the salad apart. So you would have carrots and you would have cucumbers on the salad, but we're, we just took the salad apart and we're just gonna have components of the salad. All right, so thank you guys so very much for watching. If you haven't already, please do subscribe. Make sure you turn the notification bell on so you can be notified whenever one of these. Can you please, I mean, there. All right, guys, so thank you so very much, as always, for watching. If you haven't already, please do subscribe. Make sure to turn the notification bell on down there so you can be notified whenever one of these videos goes live. Don't forget, there is merchandise available. If you wanted to cop a shirt, yeah. yeah. I'm not, we're not wearing it. Right I was now. wearing my, my, my shirt yesterday. yesterday. Yes. So if you want to cop one of the shirts, the, web, the website is down below, brbqe.com. Shirts and stickers are available. If you haven't picked one up, please do. I would love the support. Thank you in advance, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Deuces.